Hi guys, welcome to Wikip Movie Channel. Crime thrillers are one of the most popular and beloved genres among ordinary viewers and film critics. Often these kind of movies take top places in various ratings and receive all kind of awards. We've collected 20 of these movies, and we are sure that it won't disappoint you. Now you're watching the first part. We hope that you will find something new to watch. So let's not waste any time and begin. The Town there are over 300 bank robberies in Boston over the year, and most of the robbers and other criminals live in the Charleston area. Doug McRae is one of them, but before that he professionally played hockey until he became the brain setter of a gang of robbers, which include his buddies. Doug and his accomplices skillfully and without a trace clean out the banks, but one day the raid doesn't go according to plan. After that, the robbers risk being discovered. This is the second Ben Affleck's film as a director, based on Chuck Hogan's Prince of Thieves. The chases and skirmishes are excellently staged in this movie, but even more attention is paid to the dramatic component. Affleck was clearly inspired by such movies as Heat and Point Break. Therefore, if you're fans of these movies, feel free to watch Affleck's film. 10th place, The Town. Uncut Gems Howard Ratner is the owner of a jewelry store in New York Diamond Street. He takes money from colleagues at high interest rates, doesn't give anything back and runs away from the collectors, because he's sure that soon everything will change. The rare opal was brought to him from Ethiopia, which glows with all existing colors and resembles a small pocket universe. Howard is going to sell it and get rich, but everything are not going according to plan and Howard is getting more and more involved in trouble. A dramatic crime thriller by the very talented filmmakers Safti. In 2017, they announced themselves with another crime film, Good Time, which was warmly received at the Cannes Film Festival, and Safti was instantly compared to classics of crime films. With Uncut Gems, they confirmed that they deserve this award. It is really intense and dramatic movie, and was highly appreciated by both professional critics and ordinary viewers. Also, it has already been included in several lists of best movies in the decade. Ninth place, Uncut Gems. LA Confidential. Events take place in Los Angeles in the 50s. In the center of a plot are three police officers. A young lieutenant Ed Axley received the rank of detective. An indomitable brute, but white, formidable on the outside, but fair in the inside, and Sergeant Jack Vincent take bribes and advices the TV series on cops' lives. The visitors of the Night Owl Cafe are shot, and Bud's former partner was among them. This case seems common to all, but not to this trinity of cops who being their own investigators. The movie perfectly conveys the style of 50s, and visually it refers to neo-noir genre of cinema, where there are no positive characters. An excellent crime thriller that has deservedly received awards, including the Academy Award of Best Adopted Screenplay. 8th place, LA Confidential. Drive. The main character is an unnamed driver who fixes cars in a car service during the day and moonlights as a car stuntman in the movie. But at night he helps bandits in robberies, giving them a lift and taking them away from their crime scene. His silence, term disciplined, doesn't tolerate when something doesn't go according to plan. And as for driving a car, then he simply has no equal. One day the driver meets a cute girl who lives next door. Trying to help her, he is forced to get involved in a criminal showdown. The movie received nominations and an award at the Cannes Film Festival, and because of its 80s atmosphere and chic soundtrack, it becomes one of those who revived the popularity and interest in the retro wave movement. Ryan Gosling has played one of his best roles, blooded and determined man with a mysterious past. 7th place, Drive. The Talented Mr. Ripley Tom Ripley wasn't born in a wealthy family and could only rely on himself in life. Once wearing someone else's jacket with an element of prestigious university, Tom is mistaken for an honorary graduate. Ripley is in no hurry to explain that the jacket is someone else and continues to pretend that he belongs to high society. Thanks to his lies, Tom gets an offer, but the further, the more you have to lie, and the situation becomes more and more tense. 
The Crime Thriller is an adaptation of the novel with the same name by Patricia Highsmith. Received five nominations and the Academy Award and Golden Globes, but lost to other films that year. A tense movie with bright, convincing characters, a fascinating story, and cunning moves of the protagonist. The film does not lose its relevance over the years and will definitely appeal to all fans of the genre. Sixth place, the talented Mr. Ripley. American Gangster. In 1968, the famous bobster Mabley Johnson dies in Harlem. Unexpectedly for everyone, literally in a matter of months, the quiet driver of the deceased Frank Lucas earns authority on the streets and builds his own criminal empire. His speciality is heroin, which he imports directly from the south of Asia. Earning a million dollars a day and adhering the rules of the game established for himself, he became an idol of all of Harlem. But Detective Richard Roberts is already following a Frank footsteps, an incorruptible policeman who hits a new anti-narcotics unit. The movie turned out in the best traditions of film about the mafia and fully justifies its name. Because the personality of Frank Lucas was really very iconic in New York, one of the best films by Ridley Scott. Fifth place, American Gangster. Joker, Gotham, early 80s, global economics problems, and the class stratification of society has reached its peak. The people despise the rich, and crime has become the norm. The main character is named Arthur Fleck. He is a loser comedian who lives in a slum with a sick mother who once worked for Thomas Wayne. Fleck is diagnosed with a personality disorder, has suicidal thoughts, and reacts to any stress with an uncontrollable burst of laughter. At the same time, Arthur tries to be a good person, but in response to goodness, from the time to time he receives only bullying. Fleck gradually begins to go crazy. A brilliantly produced film that combines elements of crime thriller and psychological drama. The director of the film, Todd Phillips, was clearly inspired by Martin Scorsese's crime classic Taxi Driver. The Joker has little to do with the usual movie comics and thus becomes a new round of the development of this genre. The film received well-deserved Oscars for the soundtrack and the main male role, as well as the many other film awards. Fourth place, Joker. Ocean's Eleven Danny Ocean, a seasoned and elegant thief, leaves prison in order to immediately get involved in new adventure. He will help to carry out the most complex and large-scale casino robbery. Literally overnight, Ocean picks up a team of professionals and presents an ingenious plan in which each is assigned a small but significant role. A dynamic and addicting crime thriller with the great stars of the first magnitude. The plot contains a whole series of puzzling tricks, traps and distractions, thanks to which the heroes will try to do the highest of the century. And this happens with such ease and grace that two hours of screen time fly by in one breath. This is a remake of classic film of the same name with Frank Sinatra, which clearly managed to surpass the original. And in general, this is one of the best movies about the robberies. Third place, Ocean's Eleven. Nightcrawler. Louis Bloom doesn't shun the darkest work, and when there is none, he's ready to commit a crime. First, stealing small things, a young man stumbled upon a group of freelance operators in a night city who earn money by being the first to arrive at the scene of an accident, make an exclusive report, and then sell it to TV channels. The job is just right for Louis top speed and a lot of money. However, very soon, line between can and not is erased, and dangerous profession absorbs Bloom Hidlong, a very atmospheric and intense movie in which Jake Gyllenhaal performed one of his best roles. Louis Bloom is a classic anti-hero who combines both positive qualities such as outstanding dedication and negative ones. Louis uses his talents not for good things. The film received many nominations at various awards, but unfortunately, won just few of them. Nevertheless, the movie was highly appreciated by ordinary viewers, as evidenced by the high ratings on movie resources. Second place, Nightcrawler. The Departed. 
Billy Costigan and Colin Sullivan are top police academic graduates. Only now Sullivan has sent to the police by crime boss Frank Costella to leak information of the Mafia. And Costigan uses to commit a crime, so the Costella would pay attention to him. As espionage goes both ways, the operations to both are constantly disrupted. Both the police and gangsters begin to guess about the rats and their ranks. A masterfully staged movie with an elegantly structured plot, the confrontation between the main characters can be compared to chess game. Everything is so cleverly played out and dashingly twisted here. The characters are perfectly written and performed by the stars of the first magnitude. The film won four Oscars, including statues for screenplay, best director and best movie of the year, one of the best works of Scorsese, which became a crime thriller classic overnight. First place. The Departed. Well, this is it. Thanks for watching. Share your movie impressions in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe and put the big thumbs up. See you. Bye.